All right, I'm going to start a restoration project here. This is a um, red line TNT bird. You can see it's in pretty rough condition. Looks as though it's been painted before, obviously. It looked like it was uh, an aqua blue. Down below that blue enamel paint there. So, yeah. Let me see if we can pop those rivets and uh, get to it. All right. All right, I have this car separated. Uh, chassis looks like it's in pretty good shape. I'm not going to stress too much over that. And we're going to strip this thing in real time. And uh, I'm not going to use stripper. Uh, even the interior looks really good. Let's see, let me see that. It's really clean. And maybe the window needs to be cleaned up a bit. Polish that up too when it's all said and done. I'm not going to drill the engine out of this car. What we're going to do, got ourselves a little thing here. And, uh, I need a larger dish. Be right back. All right. I've been working on this for about 45 seconds here. This is lacquer thinner that it's soaking in. And as you can see, um, it just comes right off. All right. So here's our TNT bird stripped down. I mean, the casting is not in bad condition, really. I did my best to get all of that blue out of there in the engine compartment. Let's see if we can get this. There we are. I got a clear coat on here. I guess the next time you see this thing, we'll be putting it together. I'm hoping that the engine compartment came out all right. It looks like I got it uh, taped up pretty well, but I don't want to go messing with it right now, so I'm let it dry really good. All right. All right, guys, here's my finished product. Overall, I think the paint job came out fantastic. Um, I did not replace the wheels. They're original uh, 1969 uh, Hot Wheels Red Lines. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I should. I, I guess I should place an order at the Red Line shop to get some parts. Because, uh, you know, I guess the wheels are the Achilles heel right now. But uh, overall, the window turned out fantastic. Give you a, a look at this thing. From this low level here. I did not paint the grill. Forgive me. I wasn't sure if it was supposed to be painted or not. Because this batch of cars were so heavily painted. Like this. I don't know what's painted by Hot Wheels. Or painted by the previous owner. Again, I don't know. So anyway, getting back to my... We'll, we'll get, give you a view up high here in a minute. Just want to get down low car looks wicked. Matter of fact, uh, I should take a photo, a few photos down low here. There's a few casting marks that I could have really jammed on with some sandpaper and a file. But, you know, Hot Wheels didn't do it in 1969, so I didn't feel the need that I had to. And you could see some of those casting marks here along the side towards the bottom. But to me, overall, it doesn't look that bad, you know. It looks really good. Yeah, I'll give you a, there. You could probably see those casting marks a little bit better, or the casting flaws, I should say. Keep it going here. And the axles are in pretty good shape. I didn't touch them. I didn't move them. I didn't bend them back into place. One looks like it could be uh, adjusted a little bit, but I'm not going to worry about it. This is a really nice angle for this uh, this car. Overall, everything cleaned up really good. The interior was flawless and thank god there was no paint on it and just a little bit of paint on the windshield and that cleaned up really nice too all right so i'm going to lift the camera up it's going to get a little shaky i'll try to be as steady as i can and uh 
there's our paint job. I did a pretty good job, I think, of taping that engine up because remember, I didn't drill out the engine. It was just something I didn't want to have to contend with if I didn't need to. And the uh, reason why I'm spinning this car by hand is I can't find my cord for my, my table there. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. You know. It's a good looking car. My house has come a long way. Yeah. Great looking car. So anyway, I'll wrap it up here. Oh, by the way, I will give you a little um, introduction to my next video. It's going to be in a live 55. I've already got it taken apart and uh, pretty much stripped the paint off of it. But the uh, hood's in good shape, as you can see. And I'm not sure what color I'm going to go with. I think I'm going to go back with red. It was already painted uh, it was originally red, and then somebody came back and repainted it with red. And uh, here we are. So that'll be my next project. So, thanks for watching. Oh, by the way, one more thing. I was going to paint the roof black, but again, I'm not that schooled on red line Hot Wheels. Were all these roofs painted black on the TNT bird? You know, leave a comment below. And, uh, yeah, stay tuned for another video. Hollow up out.